Hello and welcome to the video by Trump Excel. I am Sumit Bansal and in this video I will show you how to use a day function in Excel. Day function takes dates serial number as input and it gives you the day in the given month. So let me show you how it works. I type day and I hit tab to auto complete the function. And you can see it takes serial number as input. It only takes one argument. So if I give 41699 oops double nine as the argument and I hit control enter this returns one because this serial number four one six double nine represents first March 2014 so as you would know Excel stores date and time as numeric values day function would work if you input numeric value as its argument now you can also construct a date in some other cell and give it as a reference in day function. So here I have 5th March 2014 in A2. So I can select A2 in day and I when I hit control enter, it gives me 5 because it's the 5th day in March. You can also construct a day within a formula uh, like I've done here. So I'll show you. I have 1, 3 and 2014 in cell A3, A4 and A5 so I can construct a date out of it. I select A3 ampersand and I use backslash ampersand so what I'm doing is I'm creating a date here ampersand 2014 now if you select this entire thing and hit F9 you would see that this represents a date which is 1st March 2014 I hit control Z to go back and I hit control enter and you can see this works uh, an important thing to note here is that this gets converted into a text you can see it's in double quotes but day function can handle text as well so let me show you uh, how it does it I would type the date within double quotes indicating that this is text and now when I hit enter it still works it is giving me one because it is the first day in March so date function day function would work if you give it uh, give serial numbers or if you type the date in text it would also work if the, your serial number is an output from some other formula so if I type today and I hit control enter it gives 19 because today is 19th May of 2014 so you can see today is a separate function and day would work if you give the input from some other function as well since day returns a numeric value it would also work if you add or subtract a value from it so in this case if I add 10 to it and I hit control enter this gives 29 because today is 19th so here day function returns 19 I select this function I hit F9 you can see it returns 19 and then it add 10 days to it so it gives 29 what happens if I add say 13 days to it it gives 32 so be cautious that if you add a value this day function do not return a value higher than 31 but if you do some calculation using it it can return a value which is higher than 31 so you just be cautious while using it so this is how day function works in excel i hope you found this useful thank you and have a nice day